I want to share something with you. I told it already to the it, but anyway, it just came to my head. You know, Pesach, without getting into a long thing, there's a post that says, Ani Rishon Vani Achan. God says, I'm the first and I'm the last. So there's a medrash. The medrash says like this. What do you mean God is the first and God is the last? God says, I am with the first. I am with the last. So I want to share this with you. I told you about Levitz already. Maybe he told it to you already. I took just as an example as the first Jew and the last Jew, Koznitz. In this one town, Koznitz, there was a big rabbi who was the Holy of Holiest. And also there was a mayor, a Jewish mayor. But anyway, he was converted because in Poland you can become a mayor of a city if you are a Jew. He converted, became a Catholic, hit it very big. Okay. Let me first tell you the story of the first Jew. In Koshnitz, there were 4,000 Jews. So they divided them up. The first 2,000 Jews with the Rebbe were sent to Auschwitz. The Rebbe arrives in Auschwitz, they take him to the gas chamber. He walks together with 2,000 Jews. And the Rebbe, you know, he was just so high, you know. Gewalt. So the, it was. So the rebbe looked up and he says, "Oh, what a beautiful day! What a beautiful day!" The rebbe didn't lose touch with nature for one split second. So the chassidim said, "Rebbe, you know, I just couldn't imagine. You have five more minutes to go, and, and you think it's a beautiful day." Someone said to the rebbe, "What are you thinking about?" He says, "What I'm thinking about," he says. I, I think he says, what a privilege. Our ashes will clean the whole world. Our ashes will clean the whole world. That's the first Jew. The last Jew is like this. The other 2,000 Jews in Koshnitz, they decided to bring them in the synagogue and, and just burn them alive. Everybody was in that synagogue. And this is told by an eyewitness who happens to be jumping out of the window in the last moment and he took off. He's living now in Israel. He was there. He says everybody was there and there was a little fire burning on the beaming, you know, in the middle of the shore. And suddenly we hear like they're beating somebody up and they drag in Nebuch, this little convert, this little Yidale, this mayor. And the Nazis are beating him up. He's just completely covered with blood. He's half dead already. And they tell him each time they hit him, they say, okay, say I'm not a Jew, we let you go. He doesn't say it. Bang. He says again, say I'm not a Jew, I'll let you go. He wouldn't say it. But this little low last Jew was so strong. Can you imagine? Finally, they drag him up all the way to the beamer, and one Nazi takes out the Torah, and he says to him, if you throw this in the fire, I'll let you go. So he says, with his last strength, he says, this is the holiest thing in the world. How could you have thrown in the fire? Now listen, friends, to this unbelievable height this little Yidala reached in a few minutes. You know what they did? They took the Teure and this little mayor and together they threw them in the fire, which is the highest level that you can possibly reach. Can you imagine? The last Yidale. Holy of Holiest. How much the Holy of Holiest? That means he had it with him all the time. There was just nobody there to, to bring it out. But you know what's so heartbreaking? Okay, after the six million. This Yidale died a million times not to say, I'm not a Jew. And what are we teaching our children? For them, it's nothing. They are ashamed to say I'm a Jew. He, he was ready to die a million times not to utter the words, I'm not a Jew. And how do we say I am a Jew? With how much pride. And I'm talking about this disgusting say, I'm proud to be a Jew. I'm not talking about this kind, which is meaningless. I really mean this is holy pride. It's holy glory. I am a Jew. I heard God's voice on Mount Sinai. I know what's going on. Nothing. We got to do it, we got to do it. Mm. Brothers, sisters, my mm. sister Jackie is asleep already? Mm. Okay. Never. Uh -huh.
my heart. Sister Jake is in top form. Yeah. <laughs> okay, let's sing one more song. Yes. Yeah. <laughs>